they, they change the dynamics. But in the situation of intimacy, when a woman says no, which we have a hadith about this, by the way, the, the, the hadith of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, who said if a man, a husband calls his wife to bed and she says no, the angels curse her. Now we need to look at this very instant. Oh, are you guys, are you still recording? She doesn't want to record it. Oh, they're recording me. Yeah, okay. No, are you okay with that? Yeah, that's fine. No, if you're not comfortable, let me. I'll tell him not to. I mean, if, as long as I'm not. In. Okay, that's fine. As long as you're okay with it, yeah? Okay. So, what I'm saying, sister, in a nutshell, is the following, yeah? Okay, sorry, going back to the hadith. So it says, if I call my wife like, for intimacy, she says no, the angels curse her, yeah? So now they say, oh, this is uh, uh, manipula manipulating uh, your wife, or, you know, she's telling her that she's going to get some kind of um, a curse, or whatever it may be, get sinned for not having intimacy. But the issue here is, I'm the one that's been abused. Because if I'm married, for, no, I am, yes, excuse me, sister, I'm married. If you're married, your partner you're expects... Not entitled is, to no, no, no. This, this is, what do you mean by entitled? Is my wife in... Okay, forget my wife. An individual is married. Is their, is their wife entitled to intimacy? No. She's not? No. Okay, are they entitled to love, affection? I mean, within the constraints of a marriage, you decide what's all right for you in that marriage. If you say, hey, my wife never wants to have sex with me and I don't appreciate that in a marriage, you can go no, find No, 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 we're not, we're not, we're not talking about pre conditions made uh, pre-marriage, yeah? No, I'm talking about pre-marriage, post-marriage. No, it, it is. If you're unhappy with something in your marriage, it's within your rights to end that marriage to seek out a new one. But, but, but we're not talking about that. We're not talking about. We're talking about an instant moment of one saying, "No sex for you today." Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm talking about that. Okay. So when you talk about entitlement, what are part, two parties entitled to? So for example, when it comes to sex, nothing. Okay. 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 No. 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 Who makes this condition, by the way? And secondly, am I entitled to? Is a man entitled to say that when a robber goes in the house, he says to his wife, "Go. I'm locking the door." Deal with the situation, let me know when it's done. That has nothing to do with the conversation. It does, sister. Is the, is, is the woman entitled to protection? No. She's not? Okay, no problem. If you go with that uh, um, angle, then that means she's not entitled to protection. She's not entitled. No one's entitled to nothing. Yeah? No, 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 I'm not entitled to nothing. No shopping, nothing. I'm in, not entitled to nothing. No affection, no love. No, I'm going to be like a robot. Not you. I'm not talking about you, sister. I don't think women in any... Any woman is entitled to anything from a man. In, in what sense right, do you mean that? I mean, when you enter into a relationship, it's yes. up to you and the other person in the relationship yeah. to decide what you want in that relationship in terms of love, in terms of affection, in terms okay. of intimacy. Yeah, that's cool. right, no problem. Why I, okay, you meet, you meet, a, you, you meet person A. Person A says, you're not entitled to nothing from me. And I would say, all right, that's fair, but I don't want to be married to somebody that no thinks problem. that way. Then you meet another guy and he says, you're not entitled to nothing from me. Then I wouldn't be married to any man who said something like that. Do you see the problem here? Now, no. what we've done is we've got a false reality, and in, in, no, and we apply saying, it. If, if every man said, I think if women don't want to have sex with you, that's a problem you should address. I, 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 I'm ways. not even talking about. That. I'm talking about a bigger problem here. What I'm trying to say is, when you use the term as no one is entitled to anything, then you have a society, a malfunctioning, malfunctioning society, because you're saying you're not entitled to this. Well, if that's the case. Any man walking down the road should not in any way shape feel entitled to protect a woman. He shouldn't. No, th but there's, there's a problem because now you're going to have women. For example, imagine Sarah Ever Everen, what was her name? Yeah? The, the one who got killed the, uh, by a police officer. Come on, everybody knows that. Okay, uh, guys, don't follow the news. What's oh, going on, brother? Yeah? yeah. yeah? Okay. It, it, was, it was tragic. So imagine me walking down the road and I hear, I, imagine I hear her screaming. And I think, and, 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 and I say, and I, say I, I don't care. I, I don't I'll be want to rely you. on a man to, to protect me down the street because at the end of the day, no, if you he's have no choice up, but to rely on him. No, oh, well, you I don't know. know. Maybe I'm carrying right now. Carrying what? You're not. You're not. You're in the UK. You're in no. America. <laughs> maybe I have pepper spray. Maybe I have. You know. No, you know that's illegal. You get arrested. <laughs> maybe she knows. Okay. <laughs> yeah, okay, maybe I'm a Taekwondo fighter. Maybe I can knock yeah. you out right here. Like. No, no, no. That's 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 <laughs> exception. There are women out there that can knock me out. Yeah, I have no other thing about that. Yeah. The point is this, sister. Every every person is somehow in one way in. Entitled, not that you ask for that. For example, we live in this, like, for example, Thomas Hobbes talks about contractarianism, yeah? We live in this, we live, we live in, no, I know, but we live in this land. If I cross the red line, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to say, I never agree to these laws, you can't give me free points. I, 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 do you get what I'm trying to say? You are not entitled to give me a free point. I live in this land, I enjoy the, uh, a lot of things in these lands, so I have to abide by the laws. What I'm trying to say in a nutshell, sister, is that the, the, the reality you're giving us doesn't fit in, it doesn't work. It doesn't work. And if you're walking down the road and you are being attacked, you would feel 
you would I want would somebody. That somebody walking Thank down you. The street so what do you say? The word hope. Yeah. And any husband would hope that if he wants to have intimacy, if he wants to have intimacy, his wife. And again, the hadith actually doesn't tell. The hadith doesn't actually say that you have to force her. He just says she'll be cursed by the angels. That's it. You get what I'm trying well, to say? I don't think bringing religion into it is helpful because everyone here obviously has separate beliefs. No, of course. That's what we're discussing, sister. But what I'm just saying in a nutshell, it, it, it doesn't work. In, in, we sure. all feel entitled somehow. Do you get what I'm trying to say? And there's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that. Okay, well, you can feel entitled. You can feel how. Like you do. You like. like you said, you, you would hope that. I would hope. That's good. But, you know. Why it, do you feel that hope? Why hope? Why don't you say, you know what? I, I, I would hope that regardless if it's a man, a woman, anything. No, anybody, of street, course, of course. I would hope that if I was getting attacked by someone with a yes. knife, that somebody walking along would help me. Well, that's what but talking about. I also recognize that by doing that, whoever's helping me may be putting themselves in danger. Exactly. You know, there's other factors to consider in situations like this. And I would venture to believe that I think there's things that people should be entitled to that you think people should not be entitled to. And I never said that, by the way. I'm, right, I'm as I came out of the train station, there's multiple people sleeping on the ground. Yes. Um, I think those people deserve a home to live in. Yes. I think those people deserve a warm place to sleep. Yeah. A lot of people in this country would say, oh, well, they're not entitled to anything. But maybe there, maybe some, I'm not saying. A, it comes down to human decency. It comes down to compassion. Well, well that's what I'm talking about, sister. Then why can't a woman have compassion on her husband and I think. understand. You the compassion say? goes both ways. It's a two way street. No, of course, says, of course. No, I want to stop. I'm not comfortable with this. To keep no, going. Of course. That is no, not I never, but I never even said that. I never even said if a woman says stop and the man says, no, you, you shut up. If she says to stop, then she's abusing her husband. No, 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 no. What I'm saying is if we look at, for example, the studies that I quoted, which I'll read for the camera again, the camera here. That's what I understood as well. No, no, sister. No, no. What I'm saying is, sister, when there was a study done on um, a woman's sex drive and a man's sex drive, yeah? Well, and the study is... Not, no, it's not general, sister. It's a study that was done. The study shows very clearly that a man's sexual drive okay. is nowhere compared to a woman's, meaning that how that a, always, by default. This is, this even, is, this is yes, if, look, I, I'll, I'll read it so for you, I'll read it for you. there's no woman on this planet who sex No, there's, there's, no, there's, 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 there's exclusive. There's, there's, I mean, no, there's, there's certain specific situations. We're talking job. generally, it does. Look, no, let, me, let me read the study. that is true, even if... Okay, let me read it for the sister, okay, yeah? I heard you, I heard you. Okay, so did, did you hear me? Is the case. Okay, let me just read it, just for context, okay. because before people come and start saying uh, that uh, I'm, I'm condoning a uh, husband raping a wife, yeah? The sex drive refers to the strength of sexual motivation. Across many different studies and measures, men have shown to have more frequent and more intense sexual desires than women as reflected in spontaneous thoughts about sex frequency and variety of sexual fantasies desired frequency of intercourse desired number of partners masturbation liking for various sexual practices willingness willingness to forego sex initiating versus refusing sex making sacrifices for sex and other measures listen carefully sister no contrary findings indicating stronger sexual motivation among women were found what that means is the following sister you are created in a certain way i'm created in a certain way but that's a and biological man, difference I, know, I know, it, I know, but what I'm time. saying is, biologic difference is this, a man is stronger than a woman. But I believe a woman is mentally more stronger than a, uh, a man. There's studies that show that as well. I believe women, men are women, and that's the reason why men tend to commit suicide more. Yeah, it, 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 it is a fact. So therefore, what we're seeing is biologically, that a man's desire for the opposite gender is more frequent and more stronger. Therefore, if a man comes to his wife he has married, and he loves, and they love each other, and says, I want to have intimacy, and she says, no. And when I mean no, it's not, I'm not feeling well, I'm tired, I'm on my menses, I'm not talking about that. He's not gonna say no. No, 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 but this is what I'm trying to say, sister. If this woman says, no, but here's says, the, I don't that, that means she doesn't want to be with Okay, him. okay, no, okay, what I'm saying is, is she abusing him, yes or She's no? She's not abusing him because Yes, he is. Okay, 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 you okay, you can't okay, take okay, our biology okay all right, okay, sister, if that's the case, no problem. No, 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 I'm, no, no, listen, okay. you can't take our biology yeah, Why not? When it comes to strength, we do. Okay, because I agree there's biological differences between women and men. Yes. And the reason, I, I mean, I don't know, I'm not a biologist, like, I'm not a scientist, I don't know, I can't tell you yeah. the exact science, but yeah. biologically, let's say when humans were first, like, yeah. evolving, yeah. the aim, yeah. you know, survival of the fittest, the aim yes. is to spread your seed as much as you can, yeah. populate the earth as much as you can. Yeah. But we don't live in the dark ages. We live in an age where women no have agency. No women problem. have agency over themselves and over their bodies. That's, that's fine. And we don't live in an age where we have to succumb to every biological... No, that's fine, sister, but how is it? Look, I'm not talking about the dark ages or the cave ages, sister. What I'm trying to say in a nutshell is this. 
a man, what we're seeing is there's studies that show a man's sex drive is higher than a woman. Sure, but I say that has nothing to do with. No, what it does, sister, excuse me, sister, if you have a specific need in a specific area. It's not a need, you're not okay. gonna die. Okay, 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 okay. No, no, okay, one second, okay, one second. Let's reverse it. You have Study, a hand for a reason, no problem. I mean. The studies show a woman's sex drive is 500 times higher than a man's. Ali, is this child friendly conversation? No, no, no it's not. I'm so sorry. I'm no. saying, guys, no, I'm so sorry. No, uh, yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. If there's any kids, uh, please leave the area. Um, so if, 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 is a baby, uh, she won't, uh, uh, she won't remember anything. Uh, so the thing is, if that's the case, and if a man, if a man, uh, a wife says, you know what, I want to have intimacy. And she, he says, no, you're not getting nothing. I swear to God, feminists will lose, they'll rip their hair out. No, they, they would rip their hair out in Hyde Park. He's sexually abusing her. All she wants is intimacy, some love and affection. Oh, it's okay when it's no, a woman, it's, poor no, woman. No, 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 but when it's a man, that's be a man. Not, this, is, this, is, this is double standards. No, no but that would because if I'm, in a, if I'm in a relationship with someone and I say, hey, Absolute I'm not standards. getting what I need out of this relationship, either Either something changes, or I leave, or he leaves. It's yeah, that's that right. simple. No, you find not... a partner that's not giving but you I'm what not, you want. But I'm not, not talking about that sister. Of course, if that was that man, I'll tell him to go and get married again. Right? No long thing. I'll tell him straight away, brother. This, go and get it's, married it's again. Not because, out. because, because, if it's not working out, of course. Look, in this time we have divorce. Like Jewish, in the Jewish uh, uh, religion, a woman is not allowed to get divorced until the husband initiates it. In this time we don't have that. A, a woman can go and get a divorce. A man can get the divorce. My issue is not that. There is abuse happening towards the man and I'm not saying the man has to force himself or oh, I'm not saying that all I'm saying is if she says no yeah she is abusing him and for you yes tell me why not please can, can someone tell me and with evidence why not because there must be a reason it's sister whatever she's an evil person she is the evil she's the, she's, okay so if, okay say the reason hold on so why is the reason she, he's cheating on her no you see what you're doing now you see what I mean so I'm saying there's a reason no I know I know my, my dear sister, my dear sister, I know. I'm giving you a specific, uh, uh, isolated situation. Because what are you doing? So you're so what are you doing now? Understand what you're saying. Are you Muslim? I am. You're, you're good assumptions for your sister. That's good. Maybe it's this. I understand. But what I'm saying is the following. Yeah, if the situation is that he's a good guy, he doesn't cheat on her. He provides for her. Okay. He loves her. Okay. Came home one day. She won't do that. No, then. I know, I know. I know. Okay, I'm saying well. if she did. Okay. I'm not talking about she. Look, she's not well. And it's always. So she's not always, always. always. No, no. Yeah, let's say she's doing it. She's doing okay, it always. So of course, that's not right. That's okay, not relationship. Okay, is that abuse? No. It's a type of. It's a type of. That's what I'm saying. There's nothing abusive. That's what I'm saying. No, because at the end of the day, at the end of the day, a woman has agency over herself as much as you have agency over herself. Yeah, I know. I know. Said she doesn't. All I'm saying is, is it abuse or not? I'm not saying she doesn't have agency. Of course, it's not abuse. There is nothing abusive about that. Okay, no problem. Okay, if that's the case, you walk, you walk down the road, sister. You walk down the road, a man with a man with a gun, and I just watch you get killed, and that's not. I believe that's a form of abuse. No, you know why? No one said. Excuse me. If a woman who's vulnerable being attacked by a group no. of men and I am there getting popcorn. Wow, look at that, look at my shit. One second. On no, one second. I know, what I'm trying to say is this. Is what I'm doing a part of, like she's being, she's being attacked. I have full cap capabilities to stop it or help her. If I choose to step back, like they say, the person that is silent is the, is, uh, is the silent devil or something along those lines, yeah? The point I'm trying to say is this. It's a lack of compassion, but it's not abuse. No. Exactly. It's not abuse. Okay, call it whatever you like. Lack of compassion, any other word. Except and I wouldn't be in a relationship with somebody no, that was of course not. We're not talking about that, sister. I know you wouldn't be in a relationship. The man, I'll tell the, 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 the man, if, he's, if she's carrying on like that, divorce her. The point I'm just trying to say is that men do get abused also. Men do woman, get abused. Yes, let's get this right. Just because a woman cries, it, it does, like if, if it was a woman here, well, I swear to God, if it was a woman here crying and saying, my husband, I told him to have intimacy with me and he didn't, I swear to God, we'll start a charity for her. We'll do a fundraiser right now. She'll raise 20,000 pounds. It is. But when it's a man, and this is why men commit suicide, because they can't express their feelings. If they cry, they're a little wimp. So the, the point I'm trying to make is that there are women that abuse. And when it comes to this, when we talk about biology, we show the study that shows a man's sex drive is higher than a woman's. But let's talk about physical ability, uh, uh, capabilities. A man okay, is more stronger. Oh, okay, but it was very Thank you, sister. Sorry if I got a bit passionate. No, no, that's okay. That's I get a okay. bit excited sometimes. Thank you, sister. Thank you. In a nutshell, what I'm trying to say is this, yeah? I think you maybe disagreed with me. I don't know if you... Uh, but what you can talk about it. The point I'm trying to say is, I'm more stronger than a woman. But some women are kickboxers, they're more stronger than me. They can knock me up. Generally. So if that's the case, if I'm walking with my wife, and somebody 
comes and takes a knife out. In that very instance, my wife is entitled to protection from me. Period. I can't come and say, oh, darling, you know, sort it out. Call me when you're done. She will come and say, this guy, you know what I'll be called? I'll be called the biggest names on the streets. You're a coward. You are this. You're the one, the reason she got stabbed. You are. But why is it when it's biologically that I'm stronger than her, in that very instance, it's okay. But when it comes to the sex drive, oh, no, 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 it's not abuse. 